It's been a minute since we last heard from Leonardo AI, but get ready because things are about to heat up. Now, they just recently joined forces with Canva, so you can bet that there's a flurry of innovative developments brewing behind the scenes. But hold on to your hats, my AI friends, because today we have a jaw-dropping update from Leonardo AI, introducing Ultra Upscaler. Now, you might be thinking, wait a minute, doesn't Leonardo AI already have upscaling tools? Well, you're absolutely right, they do. But this one, this one takes the cake. It is seriously one of the best in the biz right now. I've tested it extensively and this is the one that you're going to want to use for large files. Now remember, there's going to be three ways that you could access this and you're definitely going to want to pay attention to each of these three ways. That's because you'll want to see the specific options available to you in each of the three methods. Okay, so now for the first way, the first thing we're going to want to do is go ahead and generate an image with a prompt. And so for that, we're going to head over here to my Leonardo AI Mega Prompts database. Check the links in the description for the ultimate mega prompts databases plus thousands of awesome prompts. I add more prompts to it every day. Right now it has thousands of prompts, never ending with lifetime access. It's going to provide the fine tune model to use, the alchemy preset, the full prompt, and then it's going to have tags and then a lot of other helpful information. Now if I come over here to this tab called unique keywords, this is what is going to be so imperative and helpful in really getting those very stand out and unique sort of images. When I use this specific photographer's name, Meryl McAster, I'm going to get images that resemble this one right here. And these are going to be perfect for upscaling. Okay, but to start, let's go ahead and then duplicate and make this image right here and simply copy this whole entire prompt right here. Now, here's the image I made right here, but I made it in Leonardo Vision. What we're going to do for this first one, the first method and the first way in order to access Ultra Upscaler is when you're using the Leonardo Phoenix model. Now, on the left hand side, notice this. If I change my model back to Illustrative Albedo, okay, you'll notice that the option for Ultra Upscale is not available. If I go back to Phoenix, there we have it. Now I have in generation mode, I'm going to have three options fast, quality, and now Ultra. Select Ultra. Now, just because it's only available in Phoenix when you're first generating your prompts doesn't mean it's not available using other models. I'll show you how to access those with the second and third option. But for now, let's generate this one in first Phoenix. Now, while we're waiting on this one, let me first show you three amazing images I also used in Upscaler right here. Okay, so as you can see, those are pretty fantastic. Okay, now there you have it. There are my images created in Phoenix with Upscale. Looks phenomenal. However, let's really take it up a notch to really dive into how good of a job this actually does. Okay, and just like that, there it is right here. Look at what a fantastic job this did right here. If I zoom in a little bit, look at how amazing this looks. In fact, all three images look incredible. That is this Ultra Upscaler definitely at work. This really is impressive well, how good of a job it does right off the bat, which now brings us on to our second way. Now, this is going to be very helpful for you if you don't want to use Phoenix for your fine tune model. Okay, now with that said, let's come back over here into my personal feed. As we scroll down, I'm going to go ahead and then click on these images right here. Now, these images were not created in Phoenix. They were created in Leonardo Vision XL, and you can see right here. Now, all you have to do is come over here into any image and then simply just click on it. Once you click on it, you'll notice right over here that you can select this button that says upscale image simply select that and now up here at the very top you'll see three options just select ultra source image is going to be this original one and i want to have it be realistic i can expand this and i can get two options artistic and realistic i have my upscale multiplier where i can toggle the strength back and forth and then i have some advanced settings for creativity strength details contrast and then similarity for now i'll leave everything just basic and now with that in mind let's upscale this one right down here here for 17 tokens. And let's go back over here into this interstellar one right here. Now, this is still option number two, but you can also upscale it by hovering over any image. And now right here, you'll see this button that says new. This is going to be the ultra upscaler button. Simply select it. And now it brings up the same exact menu right here. Okay. Original image. 
and let's make this one also realistic and then upscale this one for 20. Now, while those two images are thinking, we're gonna download them when they're done and then we're really gonna zoom in to see the fine tuned details just to show you how when you zoom in, it doesn't lose any quality. Let's go ahead and move on now to our third option though and that's gonna be utilizing Ultra Upscaler inside of Universal Upscaler. Now, all we have to do is come back over here into Leonardo AI, go back home and on the left-hand side in the menu, go ahead and now select Universal Upscaler. This is gonna populate just like this. You can add an image by simply clicking and dragging in the middle or on the left-hand side, you could also upload from recent images or recent generations. This image was created with Ultra Upscaler. It is extremely high quality. In fact, let me come in here and you could see as I zoom in closer and closer and closer and just look at these magnificent details, you could tell this is definitely the highest quality with an amazing Ultra Upscale. This is as close as it can get. Look at the details of her eyelashes, the water, even her pores, and then the fine details of her eyebrows and even her eye color. That is just incredibly impressive, the details on this using Ultra Upscaler. Okay, now let me just show you one more thing and then one more piece of awesomeness. Here are my images over here I upscaled. Let's click on this interstellar one right here. Now, right here I have original selected. If I expand it, now you'll notice in order to get access to your ultra upscaled one, that is where you select this arrow for the drop down box. And now you have original, and then we have variation one, and then we also have variation two, depending on which one you like the best, and then go ahead and download that one. Now, if you really wanna take things up a notch and see how good this looks, Let's add a twist to it. Let's now select image to motion. Let's create a motion video from this one. Hit generate. Wait till you see how well the combination of ultra upscaler with motion does. It's gonna look like an amazing feature film.